Hi folks, I'd like to share with you my iOS development experience. Okay, now we are going to talk about simple Instagram integration. So, if you like to know how to export image from your image editor application to Instagram, you came to the right place. Okay, so let's create a new project. It will be a simple app. Okay with single view the name is uh, simple instagram app great uh, so we are going to use arc and storyboards i've already upgraded to is 6 and my xcode version is uh, 4.5 so if you see some strange symbols in storyboard file don't worry okay um, at first uh, we need to create a user interface for our application uh, go to storyboard cool uh, so uh, we need to send image to Instagram app so let's add a square we image view. Also, we need to add share button and uh, an action to this button. Also, we have to get the image from uh, we image picker controller. It's simple. So we are going to add an get image button. Also, we need to add uh, outlay for our image view. Let's go to our view controller. At first we need to init image picker. Then add delegate to image picker. Allow edit photo in source. Uh, so now we can show the picker. These tools are native for getting image, so uh, you can use this feature in most cases, even if you'd like to get an edit video. Here is warning, we have to add del delegate implementation at the protocol to all view controller class. Um, here's nothing. I need to add some photos, so let's go to Safari and add some photos from Google. Okay, here we go. Uh, great, it works. Where can we get choose chosen photo? Uh, we go to image picker controller declaration. Okay, methods are here. At first, we need to close the picker. The photo we get, we can get from the file info dictionary. Here we can find the key that we need. It works, cool. Let's go to the implement Instagram integration. So we are going to the website with Instagram API. Here 
here we go. Uh, every app in iPhone has its own folder and you can tra get any file from another app folder. It's a really good approach for security. That's why Apple provides some stuff for sharing documents between applications. Also, you can use URL schemes for opening some app which use this URLI. Great. So we need to use Documents Interaction API. Okay, at first we need to save our image as file. We are going to create a new path for this file. It will be placed in our application home folder. When we delete existing file from this path and we finally save the image to this folder. Now we can create a new UI Documents Interaction controller using our file URLR. Then add delegate and UTI from Instagram site. Cool. Now we can show our customized controller. Okay, how it works? Um, let's check. Nothing, nothing. Because because we can install Instagram in our simulator. So I need to test it by myself. Okay, cool. Here is a few issues. At first, we have to create property for document controller controller because uh, of after release. Yeah. Uh, after that, we should check an image resolution. The only requirement is that the image is at least 6, 1, 2 pixels, tail and or white. For best results in the gram preference, open a JPEG. If the image is larger, it will be resized dynamically. Uh, so, okay. Uh, it's okay, we just need to check that. Here is free to all. Okay, here is front resolution. What we should we do? You can create an our image view. Let's create an image view with suitable resolution. After that, uh, insert uh, B outlet for new image view. Let's add new text so we can see that we are working with this UI image view. Also, we have to set aspect fit if we'd like an image to look nice. We can add uh, a label on the image view, so we need to add this image and label to UI view at first. After that, we need a pointer to this view. We need to hide this view out of user, it's just for image exporting. Here is a good code for getting thumbnail from any views. I don't like to waste our time for describing this code. This code gets all the pixels from UI image view and saves them, them uh, on UI image. So I think you should know only basic principle. 
So we just take this code. Here is an, an error. Compiler does no CL layer. That's why to fix this bug we should add quartz core framework. Ok, here we go. Uh, we are almost done. Let's create new UI image to store the, the thumbnail. Let's launch the code. Hmm. The image height is less than uh, 612. And I found some bugs. We have to hide drive view after getting to nail. Okay, so the image didn't fill all the image view. Let's increase image view size to 1000 uh, pixels and let's try again. Ok, it works, and I see label with text. Cool, simple app for Instagram integration works. Thank you for watching this video.